I love it. Thank you, but I ain't gonna be able to wear it to get through. But I love the color and everything. When is Chicken Wayne and the Nightmares up, coming up, back? Come up, they come okay, up. Okay, that's fine. Can you raise my back sure, up a little bit right now? Oh God, not so, not so fast, please, please. The foot, the foot. That's a foot button. The foot button. The foot, the foot button. What are you gonna erase? The foot of the head. Oh. The foot, look, Kevin, my leg is broke. You're killing me. You are you are absolutely killing me right now. I'm telling you. Okay, okay, okay. Please, just stop. Just stop, please. Okay, okay. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm snappy. I'm sorry. Please, please. Hey, they can't, uh, uh, the camera's not looking at my no, gown, no. is it? No. Come on, put it down here. A bit. First of all, you told them we don't anybody know where we are, right? Well, they understood. Hey, before we go any further, you know, no one's supposed to know where we are, right? Correct? All right. Okay, if you raise it down one more time, but please do the right, the button on the right. Down or up? Yeah, okay. Okay. Yeah. Wait a second. Wait a second. Wait just a minute. Who is? Get. Oh, I just where's, where's my glasses? They're my over glasses. there, Jimmy. Let me get rid of this. No, they're over there in the thing. Let me get rid of this. Okay. I'll That's get these out of your way. Okay. Here. Here I don't good. want those stupid letters anyhow. Okay. 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 Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Here's my here. I'll, I'll move. I'll move my present. Okay. All right, everybody wants to know the condition of Jimmy Hart and the condition of the first family. Well, let me tell you something right now. Don't you worry about Jimmy Hart's condition or the first family's condition. You people of Memphis, you better worry about your condition right now because let me tell you something, man. You are very sick. You all need help so bad. I need to try to bring in about 50 psychiatrists to help you out because, buddy, you are in trouble. I've lived in Memphis all of my life, and I've never seen the worst taste of sportsmanlike conduct in my life from you people out there. I climbed in the ring, a Christian athlete all of my life, Memphis born and Memphis bred, an athlete, high school athlete. I have done everything for Memphis, Tennessee to put it on the map that I could possibly do. Cut million seller records, everything. Climbed to the top of the ladder in professional wrestling and brought you in the best talent that has ever been in this territory. And I crawled in that ring Monday night with Jerry Lawler. And he used a chain on me and he used salt on me. He used everything humanly imaginable. And you people were laughing and cheering. When he came off that top rope, which is illegal, you people went crazy. If he'd have had a gun, let me tell you something. If he'd have had a gun and blown my head off, these people would have gone crazy, Jimmy, Kevin. If he had an axe and said, let me cut off his head, they would have said yes. You know why? Because it's like I've told you before. All these Southerners, it isn't just Memphis. It's all the Southerners are sick, Jimmy. This is what's wrong with society today. They are sick. This is a real sick society. You could see it on their faces. There's faces that looked exactly like Kern's face, looked like Lawless' face. They're all sick. And, Jimmy, as you know, the only thing sane in this world today is the family. We're the only guiding light left. We're the only thing sane. You look at the rest of society. Like you said, they were yelling at you everything, Jimmy, and that was your hometown. Can you imagine how it is for outsiders? They're just sick. But don't worry, the family will be taken care of. You're still the brains, we all know that. And tell those people what the condition of the family will continue. There I is love you, I love you, baby. Let me just say something right now, Jerry Lauder. I hate you, brother. And if I have to gain weight, if I have to gain 45 more pounds to weigh 200 pounds and come in the ring to get you, I promise I'll do it. So you want to know the condition of Jimmy Hart? Hey, I've never had a broken leg before, so I don't know how long I'm gonna be out. But let me tell you something, Lawler. Sure, you kick mine, you know what? Hey, wait and a you second, broke Jimmy, Jimmy. Never ever say that, baby. Never say that. He didn't do it. You look at that Kern. What did Kern do when you were managing the match with Chick? He went down there and snatched you up, picked you up, and drove you on his knee. Oh, he's a big, tough, strong guy. Drove you on his knee. That's when you probably get the fracture. Then, with that great fighting heart, that heart that very few people have. You crawled in the ring against Jerry Lawler when he had his four henchmen around the ring. And if they want to play back the tape, they can see all five of them punching and kicking at that leg, which was probably fractured at the time. And then Jerry Calhoun came in and said, do you want to stop the match? And Jerry Lawler said, let it continue. The Promotion was part of this conspiracy. The whole thing was to get rid of the first family. Because, Jimmy, I felt like a trapped dog trying to get through that fence when I saw what was happening to you. You know what Eddie Mullen came up to me and said? He said, take one step out of here and you're suspended for a year. That was the whole thing to get rid of the first family. But let me tell you something, Jerry Lawler and Steve Curran. You listen to me right now. We have a plan. Don't you? Okay, that's it. Cut that. Cut it, interview. Let's get it.